Hi, I'm Tisha Angel. We're preparing a traditional Zulu steamed bread. Uje, the recipe. Traditional steamed bread, ujeke. It is often cooked by different South African tribes. They use different names for it, but in Zulu, the steamed bread is called ujeke. It is cooked in almost all family gatherings. However, it does not require a special occasion for your steamed bread to be cooked. You can enjoy your steamed bread with any side of your choice, but it is best served with meat. We will follow a recipe. A recipe is a set of instructions that describe how to cook or prepare something, especially a dish of prepared food. Get to know the ways of cooking. Frying. You can fry an egg omelette. Boiling. You can boil beef noodles. Baking. You can bake muffins. Steaming. You can steam dumplings or and steamed bread. Get to know the ways of cooking. Frying, boiling, baking, steaming. Words to use when cooking, baking, or boiling food. Mix the ingredients. Add some spices. Pour water. Boil water. Sprinkle some salt. Serve in a plate. A dish of sliced steamed bread served with chicken, curry, and green salad. To make your steamed bread, you need these ingredients. One spoon of oil, half a cup of warm water, three cups of flour, half a spoon of salt, two spoons of sugar, two spoons of instant yeast. Resources to use. You need a spoon, two bowls, a cup, a plastic wrap, an electric steamer, and a kettle. Steps of steaming a Zulu steam bread. Step 1. Put 3 cups of flour in a mixing bowl. Step 1. Put 3 cups of flour in a mixing bowl. Step 2. Add 2 spoons of instant yeast in the flour. Step 2. Add 2 spoons of instant yeast in the flour. Step 3. Add sugar, then add salt onto the mixture of instant yeast and flour. You can use white or brown sugar. Mix the dry ingredients with the spoon. Step 3. Add sugar. 
then add salt onto the mixture of instant yeast and flour. You can use white or brown sugar. Mix the dry ingredients with a spoon. Step 4. Pour a cup of warm water in a small bowl. Step 4. Pour a cup of warm water in a small bowl. Step 5. They say water and oil do not mix, but add one spoon of oil into the warm water in a small bowl. Step 5. Add one spoon of oil into the water in the small bowl. Step 6. Pour the mixture of oil and water in the bowl with dry ingredients and mix. Step 6. Pour the mixture of oil and water in the bowl with dry ingredients and mix. Step 7. Cover the mixture with a plastic wrap. Let it ferment for 30 minutes. Step 7. Cover the mixture with a plastic wrap. Let it ferment for 30 minutes. Step 8. After 30 minutes of fermentation, you can take the mixture and put it in the electric steamer. After 30 minutes of fermentation, you can take the mixture and put it in the electric steamer. Put two cups of water in the electric steamer, put the base plate and steam for 45 minutes. Put two cups of water in the electric steamer, put the base plate and steam for 45 minutes. Step 10. Keep adding water on the electric steamer. Let it steam for 45 minutes. Keep adding water on the electric steamer. Let it steam for 45 minutes. Finally, after steaming for 45 minutes, slice and serve your steam bread in a plate with your favorite curry and salad. Enjoy! Now you know how to prepare the dish. Let's review all the steps and the ingredients. Check your ingredients. One sp one spoon of oil, half a cup of warm water, three cups of flour, half a spoon of salt, two spoons of sugar, two spoons of instant yeast. Check your ingredients. One spoon of oil, half a cup of warm water, three cups of flour, half a spoon of salt, two spoons of sugar, two spoons of instant yeast. The steps to follow. Step one, put three cups of flour in a mixing bowl. Step two, Add two spoons of instant yeast in the flour. There's the instant yeast. Step three, add sugar. Then add salt onto the mixture of instant yeast and flour. You can use white or brown sugar. Mix the dry ingredients with a spoon. Step four, pour a cup of warm water in a small bowl. Step four, pour a cup of warm water in a small bowl. Step five, add one spoon of oil into the warm water in the small bowl. Step five, add one spoon of oil into the warm water in the small bowl. Step 6. Pour the mixture of oil and water 
in the bowl with dry ingredients and mix. Step 6. Pour the mixture of oil and water in the bowl with dry ingredients and mix. Step 7. Cover the mixture with a plastic wrap. Let it ferment for 30 minutes. Step 7. Cover the mixture with a plastic wrap. Let it ferment for 30 minutes. Step 8. After 30 minutes of fermentation, you can take the mixture and put it in the electric steamer. Step 8. After 30 minutes of fermentation, you can take the mixture and put it in the electric steamer. Step 9. Put a cup of water in the electric steamer. Put the base plate and steam for 45 minutes. Put two cups of water in the electric steamer. Put the base plate and steam for 45 minutes. Step 10. Keep adding water on the electric steamer. Let it steamer for 45 minutes. Step 10. Keep adding water on the electric steamer. Let it steam for 45 minutes. Finally, after steaming for 45 minutes, slice and serve your steamed bread in a plate with your favorite curry and salads. Enjoy the dish.